How's it going guys? Welcome back to my channel. As always, it is a pleasure to meet you guys and hopefully you guys are having a great day. Well, just a few weeks ago, I got a package to for my passenger seats, which I am very excited about because that's one of the things I've been looking forward to ever since I got the bike. I feel like I'm confident enough uh, that I practice enough to be able to start carrying passengers if I need to. I mean, if I don't need to, I mean, that's cool. I mean, it's going to be like normal riding, but if there's ever a chance that I need to carry somebody for whatever reason, I feel like I'm more confident that I, sh I should be able to. Still, I mean, I'll still need to practice. Good thing is I still have my sister and she'll be able to help me practice a little bit in that sense. But all right, guys. Well, in that case, let's get started on this install. The only thing that we really need is just a few hand tools and, well, things that we receive through the package through the mail now one thing i do notice is that i already start, got started to take the uh, screws off on this side which i only need just a few little tools right here i got this extension but it's going to be a t40 uh, torx bolt a remover i got myself my little i say little but i got myself my wrench here which is also an extension so especially since these were very tight I was able to just extend it get them out and out of the way and makes it a little bit easier I was planning on using the other one but since uh, the other one was I would have to remove all of this and transfer it. I was like you know what I might as well just take this one off and just install this one and that's what I'm gonna be doing so let's go ahead and get these things installed while not making any trash. And just like that, it is installed, secured, should not be going anywhere. I will be removing this little silver thing right here just because I won't need it because this is what holds in the exhaust, the stock exhaust, which clearly I don't have it anymore. And this is going to be a kind of an eyesore just seeing this like just shine when everything is pretty much blacked out. And that's definitely one thing that I could say about this. But I mean, since it's kind of dirty, you can barely tell unless you really pay attention to it. But either way, I say it doesn't look too bad. Now time to get the rear seat installed. All you need to do is just take these two bolts off and get started on the seat. And just like that, we are done. Well, I am at least. But if you guys decide to tackle this assignment, I'm pretty sure it, you should be able to get done. Like I said, you only need a T40 uh, Torx bolt. And on that one, you needed a hex bolt that was like, I think it was a five millimeter. Uh, they do provide the other screws and all the hardware that you need. So at least there's that question out of the way. But I mean, seat itself doesn't look too bad. I mean, just touching it, as you could see, it's kind of hard. But here are the little pegs. You just put it in and out. It's really not that bad. Either way, the seat itself is not too bad. It was not that expensive as well. Uh, the links are going to be in the description for it. Uh, same with the T-Rex Racing, uh, not roll cage. Again, that's for cars. Crash bars, that will also be in the description. And pretty much everything that's on this bike will probably be on the description. I do have another thing that I will be setting up on my bike, which is going to be mainly for cargo use. So that's going to be exciting, at least for me. That way I don't have to carry everything on my back with my backpack. Or if I ever need to do any other errands, I could just put them in the back. I could just put them in the back and not need to worry about and they have this little latch right here, so that's going to be nice to have as well. But yeah, I mean, other than that, it's a relatively easy install. I'll probably be posting it on my on the Facebook group that I have. And especially if you guys enjoy the video, let me know. And let me know also what type of other contact you want to have. I definitely want to start doing more stuff, uh, especially when it comes to being around my motorcycle. I definitely need to have this thing washed up. So that's probably the next thing that I'm going to be doing as well. But anyway, other than that, it's going to be pretty simple. The install for the cargo will also be up. So once I have that 
installed i will also have that linked in the description and yeah i mean if you guys like the uh this content please let me know and hopefully you guys have a great day